This episode is sponsored by Cyberlytica, combating fraud, account takeover, and information warfare. Get a free dark web password scan now from Cyberlytica. Use promo code HACKED AGAIN. My guest today is the founder of Identity Protection Planning, Dana Mantilia, and her company help people protect themselves, their families, and their businesses from identity thieves, scammers, and cyber criminals. Dana shares educational content on her social media platforms that is easy to understand and a bit humorous at times. Dana, welcome to the show. So what keeps you up at night? Well, thank you for having me. Uh, I would say one of the big things that keeps me up at night is the fear of um, the synthetic identity that's being created with our children's social security numbers. Uh, This is a big thing that most people are not aware of. And most people really don't think they have to pay attention to their kids social security number because no one's supposed to be using it. So it just kind of, you know, they, they don't think that they've exposed it anywhere. And the problem is all these data breaches that are happening here, there, and everywhere. Every time we turn around, we hear about another data breach. So we really should be freaking out every time we hear about a data breach, but unfortunately, because they happen so much, you know, oh yeah, another data breach. So what happens is, um, I don't need to get into the whole thing of how a synthetic identity is created, but it's very easy for an identity thief, if they can get their hands on a child's real social security number, that they can then create a fake persona, a synthetic identity that they can uh, then build their upon that credit and then one day just dump it. And typically the time when parents and kids find out that this has even happened is when the child is applying for a loan for the first time and probably maybe either their first credit card or a college loan. And that's really, really sad because that's a time when the last thing you wanna be doing is cleaning up a big mess for, um, you know, before you can even apply for your college loan because you have you know hundreds of thousands of dollars in debt that you didn't even do so that would be definitely something that keeps me up at night yeah i I could certainly see why and i I could certainly relate i have have two teenagers now that are looking at colleges and other things similar to yourself and that that is a concern if somebody compromises their social security number it could be game over big mess especially with loans and cars and everything else they're trying to do well, thanks so much for sharing that insight. T- tell us a little bit more, Dana. Where can people learn about you and some of the great work that you're involved in so they could reach out and hopefully connect and chat with you? Sure, yeah. Well, I'm always on LinkedIn, so you can always find me on LinkedIn. Um, our website, which is identityprotectionplanning.com. Uh, you can reach me there. You can check me out on YouTube and see some of my videos there. So that's probably the three big places to can track me down. Great. Well, th- thanks again so much for joining us. Really appreciate your insight. Oh, you're very welcome. Thanks for having me.